Hello fellow engineers, we're back in Kerbal Space Program! And... <laughs> Did you see that? I swear that, that guy's mouth was just juddering. Uh, it's going. Zoom in on that, Schmike. Bottom right. <laughs> we're gonna build a bridge. This finally happened. I reckon I can do it now. I, I've learned the ways of the Kerbal Space Program. We're gonna build a space bridge. Okay, so what... How... Well, I'm not so confident now. <laughs> uh, okay, command pod will surely be required for a bridge. So before we get too far, what I want to do, I'm going to I'm going to do the usual. I'm just going to add some safety first. All right, parachute, heat shield, just in case we get up to space and come back. Right, so to build a bridge, we want like girders, we want bits of steel and stuff. I noticed in structural there is actually a girder thing. So this is literally what we build buildings and crap out of. So if I just bung one on the side, can you see? It's literally, it's an I-beam. So that is perfect for building a bridge. So yeah, what I wanted to check first was just sort of see like how rigid they are. Like, can you connect them together? Because you may have noticed in my last few videos, I've had a bit of a, a bit of a bending problem. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but that's what I want to do. I want to take this I-beam, put six of them on, just like that. And then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to get another one. I'm just going to stick them on the end because I want to see I assume they're like stuck together now somehow, like some very good welding has gone in place, I think. So there should be a way to like, ro uh, here you go, rotate, select part to rotate, there you go. So I can line them up properly, because I-beams, you don't want them that way, you want them that way around. Like if your force is acting that way, you want your I-beam to be that way, because this is the main sort of strength bit. So just to test the rigidity. I'm just going to put just a couple of boosters like on the edge and just see does it stay in a straight line or will these bend? I'm a little bit worried they might bend, but we shall see. Oh god damn. Why does this game do this to me? It, like it wants me to try stupid stuff. Like <laughs> so stupid. I do just want to see what that does. Sorry. Sorry KSP players. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, on the plus side, our beams are facing upwards. Which means they're not bending under their own weight. I don't know how launch is going to go right now though. Ready? Oh god. Let's get back a bit. Ready? Launch. Whoa. Ah! Oh crap. That blew me up. I'm gone. Okay, if we revert to launch and just launch straight away. Okay. So we survived this time. And you can see they are rigid. Yes. Oh and I nearly forgot the most important part of any design. The UK Space Agency flag. Yeah, I think that was a bit hard to read, so I'm going to paste over that and then obviously make it bigger. <laughs> uh, oh, that's nice. That's very nice. Some see-through writing. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so back to selecting the boosters. I just want, I just want little ones to start with. Yeah, they look a bit better. So we'll turn that up to six, was it? I could do with these being rotated. So I will rotate like that. That looks good. Yes, okay. And then I'll just add some nose cones. Oh god, they are a bit big. <laughs> Where's the little ones? Is that one? What? Fine, we'll go with that one. <laughs> You've got mushrooms. Alright, let's launch this bad boy. Alright, please don't explode randomly. Yes, we have survived the first step. Oh, look at our flag. We actually have a flag. Royal Britannia. Da -da 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 -da. Da, 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 da. Why are my rockets going crazy? What is going on? <laughs> I thought they were dancing to my anthem. Revert flight. Right, ready? Go. Oh, it does. They're stiff. They're stiff. Oh no, my parachute's out. Oh, I didn't do the staging thing. <laughs> it's kind of working though. Can I like get rid of my parachute for press space? No. Uh, well, that was sort of successful, I think. All I'm going to do now is make the old bars a bit longer. I just want to double check that it is rigid. Right, thanks to the commenters last time, I might be able to copy and paste. So Alt and click. There we go. Give them a bit of a rotate. Nice. Okay, so we'll try that for now. So I'll just bung these rockets on the end again. These boosters, sorry. <laughs> and let's see how strong the girder is. Incredible science being done by the UK Space Agency once again. Oh, we've got a bit of a bend. We've got a bit of a bend. 
It's like a weird fairground ride, like where all the kids are like bouncing up and down on either end. <laughs> I'm gonna try and wait for this to sort itself out a bit before I launch, I think. Oh no. Oh, they're getting a bit bent. Oh god. Oh. Oh dear. Oh look, they're not colliding. I think I have made life. It is like a weird sp ah, spider thing. Jebediah is like, what's that noise? <laughs> Nothing, Jeb. You're good. You're good, mate. Uh, anyway, we're reverting that launch. Right, we're gonna launch straight away. Ready? Fire! Yes! Oh. Oh, crap. I'm guessing Gerd is way quite a bit. Ooh, that's not going well. Okay, so now I have a legitimate excuse to use bigger rockets. Right? No one can have a go at me. <laughs> bigger rockets it is. Fire! Oh no, oh no, they're all going... <laughs> Whoa, that was carnage. This one's leading us astray, though. <laughs> oh, that wasn't nice. Okay, so good news and bad news of that. The bad news is the beams, they do bend. The good news is... I don't really... No, no, sorry, that's not good news. <laughs> that was all bad. But I'm going to try and make these a bit more rigid. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do what every good civil engineer does, and that's trust the crap out of it. I haven't even named my spaceship. Trust me. We're going space. Right, so we're on. Oh, we got a bit of stretching going. Oh, there's definitely some loose connections. And it's gone. <laughs> so they're not really connected together. Oh, that's annoying. I wonder why. Some of them are. All right, let's revert and launch instantly. Launch. Oh, she. Oh, God. What happened? Oh, I've still got my parachute. This. <laughs> Has any rocket ever gone this wrong? Look at my nose cone. It's tiny. <laughs> that wasn't great. On the plus side, we might survive if we ever make it to ground. Yes, successful launch. How was that, Jeb? All right? Okay, so for some reason, not everything was connected. So what I might do, I noticed there's these sort of little eye beams. So I might just bung them in. Like I'm pretty sure they were disconnected. So I might just try and... Oh, does it only connect to the ends? I think maybe that's it. Yeah, looking at this, I think that's where I've cocked up. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. I think I've got to make sure the ends are lined up. Honestly, delete. Oh, that's going to be a right nightmare. <laughs> if I can get one trust to be good, then we're nearly there. I feel like that's just a crap triangle. This is the best triangle. So I'm actually, I'm going to take that. I'm going to delete all of those. And we're going to shove this triangle on there. That's almost there. That bottom one, that is loose. No, they're not connected. Oh, it's going up, though. It is going up. Oh, no, they've, they've gone a bit mental. Yeah, okay, I do need to fix those trusses for sure. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no, we're rocketing downwards. That's never a good sign. i tell you what, though, that might be a successful launch. All good. All good in the hood. UK Space Agency, back on track. All right, so what I'm thinking, can I sort of make a joint a bit safer by using struts? But yeah, if I can sort of cheese these together a bit. All right, we'll see if that's any better. And if that holds, then hopefully I can just copy all of that. But I feel like I might be on something. I might finally be close to building a bridge. Ah, so it appears to be holding itself better. Let's see what happens at launch. Oh, yes, no movement in the slightest. I think we've done it, boys. I think we've done it. We're gonna build a bridge. Oh god. <laughs> That's pretty spinny. Whoa. Evil snowflake. Oh, camera angle through the girders. UK Space Agency. Yes. Look, even Jeb's loving it. 
I can't believe how successful I've been. I've been pretty much to space twice now. Oh, that's a hard landing. Oh, he's fine. He's okay. He is okay, people. Right, time to build a freaking bridge. Actually, there's <laughs> always something else to do. I do just want to test, like, how long I can make these. Because, obviously, that's just one truss. I don't think too bent anyway, thinking about it. Right, that should be a bit of a better test. That's a beautiful truss if I've ever seen one. <laughs> nice and straight. Launch! Oh no. Oh no. Oh dear. Ah, I know what I forgot to do. I didn't strut the bottoms. Ah, oh, balls, I didn't turn on symmetry. Get your struts out for the lads. Alright, surely that's better. Surely. Launch. Oh shit, the lag is real. For some reason, I feel like that I might be on something there. Parachute not happy. <laughs> Jeb's fine though. So I'm going to be a bit more clever about this. I'm going to delete those. I'm going to get radio decouplers XL. Bung them on there. And again, nose cone because... I'm a professional. <laughs> so stupid. Ready? Yes. Ooh. Not quite. Not quite. They they are rigid though. Did you notice it only bent where it was connected? So I can fix that. So again, a few more struts might be needed for this. <laughs> a quick launch. Oh no. It Caved in on itself again. Anyway, good to know. Truss strong. Look at that. It survived all of them. Not like Jeb. Oops. Alright, I am just gonna strut these like to the ones opposite. I think that might stop them moving. Maybe I'll do underneath as well. So I don't know if they just work in tension or not. Well, my heat shield went a bit wrong, but <laughs> I think I've strutted underneath. Alright, we're sort of making a spider web. <laughs> this isn't a bridge. I'm still testing. Right, launch. Come on, don't twist. Don't twist. Don't twist. Oh, look at it. Bending. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Hey, look at that, though. That's cool. Oh, the lag is real. So we did survive. Right, I think, though, that's enough testing to know this is a good idea. Right, so the question is, how do I turn this into a bridge? I have a cunning plan though. So I've got a structural panel. Right, so panel there. Let's scale it up. Oh, there we go. That's a bit more bridgish. Bridgish? <laughs> yes, I think that's good. All right, let's see. Can I snap this to the side of it somehow? Oh yeah, I might be able to. Oh, why does this rotate so awkward? There you go. Right, okay, sweet. So now copy that over to this side. Rotate. Whoop. Why am I so bad at rotating stuff? <laughs> okay, rotate that way a bit. Is that straight? Right. <laughs> now can I copy that? Can I rotate on the fly? That would be nice. Ooh, well, there is a rotate. Yes. That's a lot easier. Right, I might... Should I make the rockets a bit more clever? Nah, I think... Let's just see if that's attached. I don't really know if that's going to be attached. But that's pretty cool. That's a bridge. If ever I've seen a bridge. Anyway, let's launch this. Oh, God. Okay, slight problem. I don't think everything was connected. Launch! Well, what was that? Our decouplers. <laughs> Reverting to launch. Launch straight away. Oh, God. Oh, dear. Whoa. Okay, so it's confirmed I wasn't connected at either end to the base pieces. And obviously, pretty clear then, I haven't got any cross support. So I will add a few of those quickly. Ah, so unfortunately, our piece isn't quite wide enough or long enough. 
can I scale that? Oh, I can scale it a minimal amount. There you go. All right, so a few more of those. All right, and then I got a lot of strutage to do because I want to make sure these are connected. So <laughs> it's a nice wonky bridge, just how we like it. All right, I want to do some underneath corner support. Nice. All right, so now I've just got to do this end. Oh, God, I'm so excited. Nice. Strut it. All right, I'm just speed strutting now. It's taking too long. It's taking too long. Okay, so can the UK Space Agency do it again? So it's the world's first launch of a bridge. Yes! Yes! It's working! <laughs> the UK Space Agency has done it again! <laughs> oh, man! It's actually going! Oh, no, it's tilting a bit. Please don't tilt. Come on, we can get to space. How high is space? Is it like 1,200 meters? Surely. But look at that. Oh no, we, we lost a booster. <laughs> Where'd it go? Whoa, it goes way quicker without a bridge attached. We just lost another one. <laughs> I can't believe we did it. If these don't detach. Oh God, that's going so quick. I am sorry, Jeb. He actually looks queasy. Look how fast the light's going past his face. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a bridge in space, though. Right? Please? Can I have this one, guys? Please? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> right. The question is, will the parachute work? I didn't, stupidly, I didn't think safety first. So we don't have our normal amount of parachutes. Oh, God. Come on, slow. Oh, it might be okay. It might be. Oh, Jeb's fine. We survived. <laughs> The trust beats everything again. <laughs> Next time I will be landing a bridge on the moon. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, let me know what you want to see me do next time. I'm pretty impressed with the bridge. I might continue with the structures. But yeah, peace, love, bridges. Bridges in space. See you next time. Bye. Bye.